though they're expected to be in the win column today with Dylan Cease on the mound. A big start for Cease. Verlander was not great yesterday for the for his standards against the Texas Rangers. Cease's number has dropped a little bit, down to plus 260. If he goes out there and again is one earned run or less, mm-hmm. I think the Cease number could fall underneath plus 200. What are your expectations, not just for this game, but Dylan Cease specifically? He's been spectacular, Kevin. And let's take a look since June 1st. Let's even cut out the early months where really the pitchers had the the benefit of the cold weather and I want to say the non-juice baseballs early in the season. So let's erase April. Let's erase May. Let's start in June and go right up till yesterday, which was August 10th. What if I would have told you his ERA, Kevin? A .65, not 6.5, a .65. He's been almost unhittable at this point now. Take a look at his fifth numbers, a 2.61. Best XFIP minus on the card today, and that's at a 79. He's going to be able to handle his business. And also, if you match him up today against Zach Granke, who hasn't been all that bad, he's got an ERA of under four, an average XFIP number. I think this game stays under in the first five innings. It's four and a half. It's juiced a little bit at a minus 138 price, but I think it's there. But you do a double take sometimes to look at Dylan Cease because he's not one of those pitchers that comes to mind. Hey, DeGrom and Scherzer and, you know, the Chris Sales of the past, Clayton Kershaw's, you know, Walker Bueller's, those top-level pitchers that you see night in and night out. And I guess the reason being is the White Sox haven't performed up to their capabilities as a team but he's been absolutely lights out over this first I guess you could say three quarters of the season particularly in the last 60 days over his last 13 appearances he has allowed four total runs I mean that it's It's just it's just unbelievable how well this guy is pitching right now. And against Kansas City, you would imagine he has an opportunity to dominate today. His strikeout prop is a seven and a half. It's up a little bit. It's why the juice is on that under at minus 136. But Cease is the kind of guy that uh, people I know like to see if they can climb the ladder with there. Those 10 plus Ks plus 370. Royals don't strike out a ton, so I'd be cautious. But I do think, uh, and you hear the breakdown from DRS, the expectation is he'll have himself a great game.